to the daily vlog. I'm Gary. I'm Jay. And I'm right here with my puppet master. <laughs> and uh, boy, we are so caught up in this iPhone hype, it's like, it sickens me. Wait, what? I sicken myself. Wait, you going to the Apple store for the iPhone tomorrow? <laughs> yeah. Will's just going to wait in line for, for all day and then see if he can get his iPod battery replaced. I'm well, I was going to get RAM in my Mac Mini. Yeah. <laughs> so we're really late. <laughs> but I'm actually going to be buying an iPhone. I'm going to wait in line to see if Lucas trashes like Star Wars again. <laughs> so, uh, and I'm hoping they're selling Rolling Stones tickets. Yeah. But so, yeah, I was trying to think of the last, last time I waited, waited in line for a product. Okay. And, and, and product? Okay. Well, well, the Rolling Stones is a product. Oh, okay. It, has <laughs> it is true. But, it is true. There's um, plenty of silicon and plastic. In there. <laughs> and, uh, yeah, actually, the last time I, have, I stood in line for a, anything, for any extended period of time was for Who tickets. Yeah. I've stood in line for Who tickets. Maybe even mm -hmm. been the same Who concert. Mm -hmm. not, well, not tour. Re regarding the iPhone in Denver, I think um, everyone needs to know that the Cherry Creek store is not selling any iPhone iPhones. <laughs> yeah, it's our that's right. Yeah, yeah, if you, know. you live near Cherry Creek, go to one of the in Denver, Denver Colorado. No, 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 they do, but they're not allowing people to line up till noon. That's so right. So pile in at noon. But that's right. But no earlier. And you can't buy any until after 9 p.m. So anyway, yeah. So, uh, so I sold all my Apple stock today because I don't think it's going. That might be a smart move. No. no. <laughs> Are you top kidding? Of the, top of the you're high gonna, top You're going to be so well off. What do you think? Apple sell, stock? Dave. Sell Apple stock today, or, or hold buy? On? Uh, buy, today. hold, or sell? Buy. Buy. Really? Weekend, you don't think the hype has pushed it all the way up somewhere where it can't possibly be? going to blow out. I'm telling you, there will not. Uh, they'll sell yeah. like a million iPhones over the weekend. Yes, yeah, and, 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 yeah, and I Easily. bet you you're up 10 points. Yeah. I don't know about 10 points, but I know they'll sell a million. You, here's the thing no matter what happens, somehow people will extract disappointment from one of the most revolutionary events. So, like, they could sell out every single one that they ever had for like the next five years, and they'd go, oh, but it wasn't a decade? Hmm. Apple's really kind of fallen off. <laughs> I mean, the expectations for Apple are yeah. so well, no, no, Actually, I think just the opposite for this for this six month period, Apple has been able to do absolutely nothing wrong for six months. It, it, it's just like I I, I think That's I, I'm almost sell. embarrassed to go. You know, is that I've always been an Apple advocate, and now it's just like you hear all the hype and and all the press but, and everything, and you're just going. <laughs> It's all Apple all the time. Most laptop sales, biggest iTunes, but that's uh, what ten percent that's of the market. But that's what and, they excel at. That they, you got to understand. Everybody loves to imagine what Apple's going to come out with great next. Yeah. Is so excited about it, and then they'll actually deliver about eighty percent or ninety percent of what the most amazing things were that were being imagined. And then they go, oh, well, kind of didn't meet my expectations. So so do you think that, that we're approaching the precipice then? Well, I, I'm just saying, no, I'm just saying as far as their stock goes, I think they're way undervalued, but I think they will always be undervalued because no matter what they release, no matter how revolutionary, it still will not quite seem to be I, I, I have a what we expected from Apple. I have a theory. Their stock, the Apple stock price now numerically is higher than I think it's ever been before. Typically they split and they try to keep the stock price under 50, but now it's up well over 100. My prediction is they're holding off on the split because in case the stock drops after the iPhone release, they have something they can do very easily without releasing a product, without doing any special announcement. They can simply, oh, the stock goes down because they didn't, because there were problems with the iPhone. And then in July, they can say, oh, we're announcing a stock split. And then the stock will perk right up and everybody forgets about whatever. Because you hold that one thing in reserve. That's why they haven't split, even though they should have. I think, I think the iPhone. But you'll be able to buy stock on your iPhone. That's true. Well, I guess yeah. you probably could. It'd be interesting to see. Mm -hmm. Interesting to see what can happen. But We're working on some iPhone games here. Um, oh, that's right. The whole our, arcade of arcade. Yeah, macfos.com slash iPhone games. But I have yet to somebody, have somebody to test them for us. Because we won't get our iPhones till tomorrow. And I don't know if they'll work. They're using different technologies. So it's kind of a test array yeah. of games. But speaking of technologies, you got to fit this in. Apple. 
Can you please put Flash into the iPhone? That's all I ask. Oh, all okay, I ask. either put Flash into the iPhone like like really soon, or hold off for a couple of years. Yeah, like, exactly. So either so one is good for us because so. then we can we can make some games without Flash. We're yeah, talking it. about the Flash application, not Flash RAM. Yeah. Yeah. Okay. Bye. Yeah. Hey, bye. bye.